Before you watch this video, make sure you hit that subscribe button and slap the bell to never miss another video. And also, if you like this video, make sure you smash that like button. After that, enjoy the video. Enjoy! Hello everyone, so my name is Aswick Gaming and tomorrow is the release of Occupation 2.5, the Steam version of course. So um, I already have the game right here, the Steam one, before it got launched. And I will give you guys my honest review and full review, as well as my experience after I play the Steam version. So um, let's start off with the main menu, the simplest thing. So you guys can see there's a difference. There's control and mouse. So it seems like the developer watched my videos, I guess. Right now, um, or before, it's only possible on the mobile version. However, now on the Steam version right now, now you can do it just like that. And um, yeah, I think, well, that's better than nothing, you know, that's a good thing, of course, good job there, to the action games. Alright, so second thing that I saw different compared to the previous uh, development version is the, uh, the credit here. So you guys can see, um, why should 2.4, why should not 2.5, you know, flip that, you guys can see there's the controls help or the key bindings for your keyboard there's all the escape and blah 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 all of those control thing you can check it right there I wonder why didn't the developer just put it on the options you know it would be kind of weird if it if they put it on credit so um, yeah other than that Let's just play the game. Alright, so um, let's start off with the graphic. So you guys can see, I was impressed with the graphic of this game. Now, I know it's not as good like, you know, Red Dead Redemption or other game like that. However, you have to keep in mind that how much is this game size? Can you guess it? Well, it's less than 500 megabytes. Which I'm, I kind of shocked, you know, when I saw that, I thought it was gonna be like one gigabyte or more on the PC version. But even like, even though it's, uh, even though it's like around 400 megabyte something. Well, let's just say 500 megabyte. It's pretty. It's pretty darn good, you know. I don't know what to say. It is just stunning, amazing. You guys can see the shadow there, the sun rays right there. Oh, hello there. And I think there's the... They added some bloom effect into this thing. Kinda like look, looking like glowing, you know? Alright. And um... Not only that, let's talk about other things. Such as the... This game physics. So let, let's, let's take a look at the water. Well, it's doing pretty good, I guess. There it is. Well, for the grenade, it's not like, like a splash, but at least uh, there's the thing. Like that. At least there's that. You know. Better than nothing. And then uh, that one as well. Let me just send that to the water. 
think it's one of those. Where is it? Oh, there it is. There it goes. You guys can see it's kind of floating on the water. I don't know what to call it. Um, yeah, basically like that. So yeah, that's another good detail about this game. And there's another one. The, for example, the rocket is able to uh, bounce around like that. And if you are, uh, let me just get it close like that. And um, yeah, one of the sound, the high frequency sound after you explode some things, you know. There's not. There's one more, I think. And that is the bullet ricochet. You guys can see there. Oh, flip. Oh boy. Oh hello there. And yeah. You can sometimes shoot it on the on the trash can and it, it will hit you sometimes. Good trash it. No no no. Oh flip. There it is like that for an example and it just killed me oh man I'm dead and I will respawn of course so um, yeah that's about thing that I like about this game so, yeah, the graphic the physics and some of the good details for uh, less than 500 megabyte game on PC as well. Alright, let's talk about the uh, performance. Alright, so um, right now let's talk about the uh, performance. So um, right now I'm running this on my own laptop. You guys can see there it is. Well, it's not a high spec laptop, but it's not a low end as well. It's like kind of like mid range, you know. Like not a 3090 level, but not also like an Intel Edge graphic level. It's a big upgrade, a huge upgrade compared to my old Intel Edge graphic. So um, yeah, about performance and uh, thing. Uh, this game is just lock you on 60 FPS. I don't know why, but it does that, you know. And I also have no idea. Do you? How can you? How can you uh, unlock the FPS? Not to like 60. Because of uh, you guys can see even on the max settings, right here. I would say that this game is very light. You know, you don't need like a high-end GPU or CPU to run this game. Oh, that. Yeah, yeah. Let's go to the uh, demanding part, which is the bushes, like this one. So dropping. I see the GPU is uh, up to like the forty percent. Oh, flip! Don't kill my young ones. Come here, you bastard. There we go. So, um, yeah, you, you probably like need a at least Intel HD graphic, I guess. Intel HD 4000 or uh, maybe GT 710 or uh, 610. Lower than that, I don't know. Oh, flip. Whoa. Come here, kiddos. What, you don't want to come with Papa? Oh, thank God. Alright. 
So um, yeah guys about performance Whoa. it's this game is light And I think it will run on most PC that you have So um, yeah that's about performance All right so um, for the last one here let's talk about things that I hope the developer will improve in the future or oh, oh. basically things that I don't like about this game so um, the thing that I don't like about this game is hello. that hello there um, it kind of lack of uh, some features So things like uh, this car for example I mean I really hope that this car Sometimes I can drive it you know But that is just some imagination I guess Not like uh, just a miniature or a thing you know I hope sometimes there can be uh, at least something new on the game you know I mean I know that there's a better graphic and stuff like that I mean the graphic of this game is already pretty good you guys can see but I was hoping for something new or something new like a new feature on the game yeah you still can drive this car Maybe at least uh, some... Oh crap, what the hell? Maybe something like a new weapon, new meal weapon or a new place to explore, you know? Or if the developer doesn't want to do that, then um, just... I really hope you can make a new game, you know? Because... The gameplay experience is similar, like similar like the mobile. So um, yeah, guys, I think that is my uh, basically the thing that I don't like, and I hope the developer improve next time. Hello there, and um, yeah. All right, so right now you have made it. To the final part of the video and that is the conclusion so um, do I recommend you guys to download occupation 2.5 on steam the answer is yes I do however if you don't have a PC or yeah you know like that then just buy the mobile and you will get a similar experience like the PC Except the graphic of course is the big difference I think on the PC version And yeah other than that um, There's not a big difference in terms of gameplay It's pretty similar, but um, Yeah, so um, yeah guys, I hope that this video will be useful for you that you decide my review about this game fully and I hope that if the, the 3D action games watch this video I hope that if there are any new game or if you want to improve this game then I hope I really can't wait if there's a new update or a new game alright guys so um, yeah that's it for this video and I see you on the next video as always love you all Bye-bye.